Hello from Akamak to channel. So we're outside the Vanimus right now. We need to follow her to talk to someone. As I word, we stole a big ass ship, and that was the last thing we were able to do before we got out of Animus. And let's see what's, hap what's gonna happen now. He better not fucking try to bite me, or, or else I'm gonna beat the fuck out of him. Is he my employer or what? Wait a second, how do I activate the elevator? Alright, that's how. calibrating your animus i'm sort of the uh scotty of this abstergo enterprise in charge of all the techie stuff do you have a minute oh, that's a cool oh. view ah oh, damn it the tracker says you're on your way to olivier's office ah all right i'll ping you when you're done i have a favor to ask someone has a favor to ask me outside of animals go right in he's waiting for you that's pretty interesting, so we'll actually be doing something outside of animals. How am I supposed to go in? Alright, that's how. Well, well, unless you are specifically ordering me to abandon it, I won't uh, jeopardize our flagship project. Edward Kenway is the... But this is... But this is how Hollywood got its start, right? With pirate movies. Douglas Fairbanks, Errol Flynn, and now we have access to the real deal. <sighs> wait, wait. Exactly. We'll talk about all that together at the shareholders' event. Right. Looking forward to seeing you too. Take care, Letizia. Salut! Hi! Thanks for coming in. I know you're busy. So, I reviewed some of your data. Pretty raw stuff. Obviously, we need to scrub off some of the dirt to make it family-friendly. Maybe give Edward a voice like uh, James Bond or something. More of a ladies' man. A beautiful city, no? So, the main reason I asked you here concerns something called the Observatory. It's uh, been mentioned a few times in the footage you found. I'd like to encourage you to focus on locating this specific set of memories as soon as possible. If it were up to me, on s'en I wouldn't bother. But some bigwigs at Abstergo Industries have been hounding me for days. So, follow whatever leads you find and hopefully we can... Oh, incoming call. I have to take this. We'll keep in touch. Bonne journée. Alan, bonjour. And that's a... And that's it. That's the only thing that he wanted to say to me. For real. Uh, whatever. Yeah, but that's how we know you're there. Uh, that's how we know that they're marking a game or something like that. I'm not sure what they're, what they're trying to make. A movie or a game? Alright. Log on and I'll walk you through this. So he just granted me access to random doors. That's awesome. Now, you need and to let's access someone else's animals. Because why not? Once you reach it, your communicator will download it. Oh wait a second. Uh, Alright, that's how I do that. Shit. Alright, that's not gonna work. Maybe that will. That worked. You cracked it. Good. The file should be downloading. I set up a database for any data you find. Just look for the My Files section in your communicator, and you'll be redirected right away. Everything you download will be found in there. Uh, protected by a firewall, of course. 
December 23rd, 2012. Sample recovery unit team lead Fisher Case reporting on September Subject 17, Desmond Miles. So they actually mentioned him in this part of the game. Time of death was placed around 0 hundred hours and 7 minutes with conditions favorable for DNA sample recovery. We had some initial concerns about interference in the vault, but given the skill and talent of this team, we were able to capture useful data. I personally retrieved the subject's backpack and extracted a number of objects of interest to undergo detailed analysis. The subject displayed burns to the right hand, severe enough to fuse the bones, indicating some kind of spontaneous, intense burn trauma. Honestly, we've never seen anything like it before. Head, neck, and torso remained in good condition. I hand-selected recovery agents to retrieve fluid samples, blood and saliva. We then commenced material extraction and were able to preserve several exemplary samples. Data analysis and sequencing is already underway and I'm told proceeding with exceptional ease thanks to the cloud database and the work of Abstergo Sample Recovery Unit 3. The legacy of Subject 17 will continue uninhibited as Sample 17. Alright, so let's close it. But one interesting thing that I noticed, he has the same scar on his lip that... Uh, not that word, that Ezio had. I'm not sure how he got it, that could have been in the game, but I might have forgot it, but... I don't think it was included in the game. So let's go to the lobby. Don't be a dick, alright. I'll remember that. Oh, look who's here. So you didn't forget, after all, you're just incredibly rude. And made poor Rebecca here wait for nearly 30 minutes. You lie me. Be nice. Sorry about him. He's high on his own supply. So, how should we do this? Data transfer? Great. That should do it. We'll email you the receipt. Till next time. Take care, Sean. Bye-bye. Yes, bye. And don't expect any more free coffee. Arrogant. She's great, isn't she? Exactly. Hey, and I was supposed to get down here, here just to see the people from the second part of the Assassin's Creed. No, 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 okay. They just wanted to bring them back, and that's why I had to get here. That's still, it is pretty interesting. That they, that they decided to just kind of rewind the characters. But it is time to go back in. Oi. Where are you going? The market? No, I. My parents have asked me to come live with them. And I'd like to. Oh, what do you mean, live with them? You live here with me. I'm sorry, Edward, but my father is right. You had a decent wage when you worked the farm. Why can you not be satisfied with that? With me? Decent wage? That job was near as damn it to robbery. You want to be married to a peasant the whole of your life? All right, Edward. All right. You leave now, Caroline. You never know what's coming to us. Caroline! Caroline! Oh. Oh, kid. Wake up, can we? What's that about? He left this morning with the galleon, as Faith will discover a good use for this old cove ourselves. I will make something of it in time. We could keep a fleet here if we liked. And with a bit of fixing up, it'd be a decent place to call home. Might even convince my wife to come one day. You're married, are you? In God's eyes, I am. She left me some time ago. Even so, keep that fact hid away. 
Most of these pirates don't respect a man with higher commitments than rum and plunder. Upon mine honor, let me know if you find anything. Alright, so we have a like a kind of a pirate HQ right now. And can I upgrade my ship? I don't think so, or at least not yet. And I cannot do that right now if I even if I wanted to. Cause I need to follow someone. The dude that we're just talking to. And somehow Edward still knows how where he is. Edward, over here. I found something. You must see this. I must see what. Come on, man. All right, and things, what's that supposed they? to be? Old and weathered. Is this what they call Mayan? Or is it Aztec? Are you good with riddles, Edward? Puzzles and ponderings and the like. No worse than the next man, why? I think you've a natural gift for it. The way you think and work. The way you understand the world. Well, I don't know about that. You're talking in riddles now and I don't understand a word. Clamber on top of this thing here, will you? Help me solve something. Yeah, right. Concentrate and focus all your senses. And what's that gonna be? Look past shadow. Ah, oh, right. I know this feeling. I have since I was a lad. Okay. It's like using every sense at once, isn't it? To see sounds and hear. Ah, okay. I get it. And what's that gonna do? Every man and woman on this earth has in them a kind Seriously? Of That's gonna show me the treasure? I've had this sense most of my life. Alright, so let's dig it out. What's that gonna be? You are a gifted man, Edward. Has a strange look. Is it worth something? Nothing you can spend. But if you find all of them, it'll lead to something grand. How many? A few dozen, I think. This way. I have something else to show you. Alright. So there's quite a, lot, quite a lot of them, and what is that? Mayan Stella, whatever the fuck that means. I found something else just here. I think you'll take this secret much faster. Now this has the makings of a mystery. It's good if they're not the codex pages, I will definitely not collect all of them. The and in fact, I'll only collect this one, probably. Here we are. What do you think? I think Monsieur de Casse was a man of many secrets. Aye, and look here. A solid staircase leading God knows where. What do you suppose lies at the top? From what I knew of Decas, I wouldn't be surprised to find eclectic instruments of torture and villainy. An Iron Maiden or a collection of thumbscrews. Or a pair of anguish. <laughs> Not a nice way to kick off. But that is some damn fine gear. Try the key you took from Ducas. Now, so that's what it's for. That's one. Only four left. Uh, Wait a second, that's not the stone. It might be that these four Templars have them. See the names here? Yeah, that was the key that we took from the guy that They've we killed on the Galleon. Four targets. Hang me, that's the map I sold to Governor Torres in Havana. He said it marked the location of assassin encampments. You think maybe you owe them a bit of warning then? If you have any kind of heart beating in that chest. Suppose I could. If it leads me to the four other keys. Bad excuse is better than none at all. Mm. 
All right. So I also have Templar hands. And if I'm gonna complete all of them, I'll probably unlock this. I mean, not probably. I'll for sure unlock this armor, Templar armor. It doesn't have a hood. Alright, fuck it then. It's not worth it. If it doesn't have a hood, it sucks. And I don't care. Alright, but I'm supposed to meet him again. So let's do that real quick. And I wonder when we'll be we will be able to upgrade our ship in this in this port. That's not a vantage point, seriously? No, there's not an eagle here, so that makes sense. Unless I can upgrade it here. No, or at least not yet. Okay. Can you leave this pose alone? Alright, thank you, Edward. Edward. Leaving already. I think this cove suits you best, Edward. Better than that costume does. Oh, come on now. We're pirates, kid. We take as we please and become who we like. Self-made man. But that look ain't you. It's not who you are. Who am I then? Hard to tell some days. All I know is you like dangerous prizes. Like the observatory? I think you know more about that than you let on in NASA. You noticed that, did you? Be me at 20 degrees, three minutes latitude just off the coast of Yucatan. I'll have something to show you there in a few weeks' time. Okay. And the next mission is on the ship. Wait a second, what's that? Can I build something here? You have a moment. I've been needing coin to set up the shipyard, cap. Yeah, the shipyard. We have the needful gold. The sooner our ships will. Fuck yeah! How much? Five hundred. Hell yeah. That's basically free. And was that? Of your time, my friend. The men do sorely lack a place to do their wenching and debauching. With a little coin encouragement, I could have the old place. So it's a tavern. And a flower run fit to obliterate a good tar proper like. Okay. I cannot afford that. Okay. Screw it. And the other one. Fuck the other one. What do you be needing today then? Let's just talk to this guy. Sell, sell some shit. Sugar, as always, and and rum. Okay, so I have five grand, and can I upgrade? Can I upgrade something? Full armor or or cannons? Chase cannons. I don't give a fuck about that. That is hella expensive. Let's go for this. Let's upgrade this and and nothing else. Or maybe that's worth it. That's a good idea. I can increase the amount of ammo that I can carry. Or at least my ship can carry. Cargo storage. That's also gonna be useful. Let's go for mortar storage. <clears throat> At least for now. And let's buy this as well. It is cheap, so why not? What about ammo? Let's 
let's buy a few of these. I'm not gonna buy these because I guess that I will just find them in in other ships. So that will be a waste of cash. But I have some more cannons right now, so I'll make uh, so I'll deal more more damage, and that's gonna be useful. Where does the next mission start? I guess that it does start here. Sail to sea. Oi, Captain. We found a trove of nautical maps and ledgers and the like scattered about the village. You'll find them sorted in the captain's quarters of the Jackdaw. Quality stuff. Nautical maps and ledgers. It might come in useful. We decide to build up a fleet of our own. Exactly my thinking, Captain. Have a look for yourself and tell me what you think. All right, so I'm supposed to get in here. Access fleet. Oh uh, yeah, right, now I remember. It's kind of like a mini game. And you can make money out of it. Wait a second. I already have a fleet or is it just a tutorial? Okay. Let's assign a ship. And success. 50 reals and a city unlocked and that's that's basically it, right? Yeah, right. And now it's time for a battle. So this is just a tutorial. Yeah, right, it's just a tutorial. Alright, so since I made the, this route safer, I can assign a ship to it, right? Let's assign this one since it's not broken or damaged. And for this one... Screw it. It's slightly damaged, but... This route is safe, so... Fuck it. All right. So since I since I assigned a few ships, I'm basically done in the captain's cabin. And what am I supposed to do now? That is a restricted area. And can I find anything interesting here? Holy fuck! That's a long way. But I can fast travel here. Or maybe not. Alright, I can. So, let's get back to my ship. And actually go there. Of course today, Captain. It's a fine day for any kind of mischief. What's your feeling? I'll make no secret now it's a bit closer, and what's that? Ram and sugar, I don't really give a fuck about that. I'll be a happy man. Spoken like a true Welshman, Ade. I could make some money out of it, but screw it. It's not really worth it. They're just schooners. You trust him to play it fair? I can't be sure. But he has a way of picking away at my conscience that gives me pause. I should go see him soon. So long as we take some prizes along And the I can way, take over sure forts. But I have a feeling that it's gonna be a quest sooner or later, so I'm not gonna do it now. But I don't think that they don't that they actually give a fuck about it. They're just gonna be shooting at me anyways. And I'm not able to use travel speed because It is a storm or because I'm in the middle of a fight? I'm not sure. Stop shooting at me, for fuck's sake. 
Brace yourselves! Alright. I can finally use travel speed. Wooden cloth, nothing interesting. I need some more resources to upgrade my ship. Or honestly, I think that I might be out of money for now and out of resources. But to make money, I need some resources as well. Just a different kind. And actually, what do I need for Edward's upgrades? Mm. Alright, crafting. Hell upgrade, Jaguar pelt, and Great White Shark Bone. Fancy as resources, obviously. That would be hella fucking useful. I'll have to go hunting, that's for sure. There's just no other way. I mean, I could also buy them, but I cannot really afford to upgrade my ship and I'm not even talking about buying fancy ass skins and this kind of shit. I could try to make some money out of this fleet, but for now it might be a bit difficult. I'll need some better ships for that. I'll have to be able to capture like a galleon or something. Is there anything interesting to do in this area? Not really. So let's just go for the mission. I might start uh, start it in this video and finish in the next one, but I'm not sure how long it's gonna take. It's supposed to just show me, show me something, so it shouldn't take very long. But you'll never know. There's already a factor of enemies and there are assassins. Okay. Don't kill anyone. For real. But I can knock people out, right? Right. Oh fuck. Alright, they don't care. Perfect. Next bush. Can I just take him out? Not anymore. He played us from the start. Betrayed our confidence. How could we have known? Even Atabai was taken in by his charm. Just turn around. All right. I should be able to reach this fucking out this bush right now. And now get here. I saw a ship pass this way. All right. On the shore, then gone. It worked somehow. Tabai warned us to be vigilant. Templars have been closing in for well on a year now. Indeed, but Templars make noise with their comings and goings. I've not heard a thing just yet. You will. And next bush. Come on, just turn around. Perfect. On to the next one. That will work. So, where is he? Oh fuck, there's more of them. And I'm still supposed to remain undetected. The worst kind of missions. Okay. 
Let's get rid of him just in case. To make this area safer for me. He just saw me like three times in a row and he didn't give a fuck about it. He just. Eh. Four times in a row. No, that was a different one. Awesome. You didn't see that. Obviously he didn't. Blind and deaf. Yeah, it's like, your homie was right here just a few seconds ago and now he's gone. What could happen to him? I don't fucking know. Should I be concerned? Definitely not. That's beautiful. I absolutely fucking love it. Because if not for this fact, stealth in these games would be absolutely fucking impossible. Alright, but what am I supposed to do now? I cannot just get rid of him. Unless he's not gonna be able to see me. Somehow. Fuck it. Let's just go for... Oh, he didn't see me. I didn't think they're gonna be this blind. It's more like their cone of vision is this fucking narrow. Okay. Let's continue clearing the area. Perfect. I can loot the chest since there is no one here. No one's gonna see that? No one. Perfect. He's not looking, so I can get to this bush. And now is the time. Fuck! Too soon. They're not completely deaf. Unfortunately. They're extremely deaf, but not completely. That's a shitty place to start over. Okay. Fuck off. You didn't see that. You didn't see that either. I told you, you didn't see that. Alright. Oh fuck! Seriously? There was another one? I didn't remember that. No oh, fuck, that might take a while. Alright, honestly, I'm gonna continue this mission in the next video, so hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next one.